Hello, everybody. Um, yeah, I've been <laughs> meaning to shoot like a daily writing routine um, video where I kind of go through what I want my daily writing routine to be. Um, and now Nano is coming up and I want it to do like a uh, kind of a writing routine for a Nano. So I made like a small list of um, seven things that I kind of want to talk about. Um, and I was going to write them down on this black piece of paper with a white pen and I was going to put it on my cork board which is like right behind my camera so I'm not going to show you. <laughs> Sorry I can't show you um, but it's right behind the camera so I can see it all the time. Um, yeah I have my tea in my you know appears when hot Lord of the Rings mug. really good um and I chose I was gonna do English breakfast with this video it's just because it's like 2 40 uh, a.m. it's not the best time for a black tea <laughs> so we went with relax instead but I wanted to do goal first so there it is. It's a, okay, yeah. I mean, it's fine. Right? Um, this is actually a three camera video. I have one camera down here to shoot what I'm writing. Uh, I shot the beginning, if it actually goes in, with my T, with a GoPro. And then there's, of course, my recording camera that I usually use. But yeah, goal. Um, so there's, because I'm writing film scripts and Nano is 50,000 words, so my goal is going to be 50,000 um, words. But I have two projects that I'm working on, that I'm going to be working on. One is to rewrite the project that I did uh, last year which currently is at 24,000 words. I do need to shorten it. and th But there are also things I need to add. So, so we have Project Fight, which I worked on last year. And we're just gonna write Project Fight, rewrite. And then, I have Project Spy, which I uh, tried to write the outline for in Kevin Nano in April, which didn't quite work out. I think I got uh, more than halfway through and I have finished it. Now I'm going to write the first draft for Project Spy. So we write that down. First draft. Yeah. So that's, so that's the goal to get these two things done. Uh, I don't know how long they're going to be. I'm not expecting to get more than like 40, maybe 45,000 words. But um, if I do have a plan if it comes to that. And that's something we are going to address later. Third point was... Do I want a ritual? Um, I do want to make myself a ritual. So I'm gonna write, I'm gonna write that here. Do I want a ritual? I recently started drinking tea. I, I, I still haven't really gotten into the ritual of drinking tea. I've been but I am drinking more tea now than I used to. I, I want to start drinking tea and I want to do like a cup of tea before I sit down. 
to write which is also why I did it for this video because I kind of want to have fun with the cups that I do I have multiple different cups I have cups that would really work very well for um, film videos and uh, this one being like Lord of the Rings and world building and a map I think works very well for writing but yes I, I want to do like a, a tea for writing so maybe just like for every writing video from now on I will start with like a tea making thing so that's I mean one thing I want I want to start off with a cup of tea um so let's just write start off with tea I do kind of want to like try out uh, writing with candles um try I'm just gonna write try with candles <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing capital letters but I am doing capital letters and when it comes to like listening to music while writing I don't always listen to music while writing usually I prefer if I listen to music then I either have to listen to it very quietly but that's also if it has words in it then I have to listen to it quietly I will usually go with more um of like indie uh, folk kind of stuff because it is just it's much calmer it's I'll either do that or like classical um, I do kind of want to get into the habit of like picking something specific to listen to there are things that I have um, on YouTube that are like coffee house uh, atmosphere and I want to try some of those so maybe we'll do that try atmospheric uh, music and sounds I don't think there's anything else so my ritual would be then tea uh, I might I'll probably try some things with candles uh, maybe some adversary at atmospheric blah, can't say it music and sounds we can come back to that if I want to put anything more. Next, uh, I have writing with school and work. I'm in university, I'm reading a lot of books. Uh, I don't know if I will have uh, posted the video that I shot where I literally went through all the 20 books that I have to read for this semester. And I have two part-time jobs. One which I am quitting. That's one of the reasons why I'm not gonna put myself a specific time of day I'm just gonna write here like because I want to write like an hour or two a day I so I'm just gonna write that here one two two hours oh you're writing small now okay <laughs> I will be prioritizing school and writing um it says make sure to write I took this from a questionnaire that I went through we kind of put up your daily writing routine. I haven't really gone like filled it out completely yet, but make sure to write was kind of like, um, you know, when you get these knacks like, oh, you don't have time to write, or like, oh, you can't write right now, and like, what is acceptable to actually listen to and what isn't acceptable to listen to, like, where you're gonna draw the line of things that you want to listen to and don't want to listen to. Also, uh, if somebody else asks you for help or somebody else is interrupting you with it, like, what are you going to do? Let's just start by writing no distractions. And we are back to capitals. Yay! I just wrote it down because I think it's a good thing to do. Like, how are you going to make sure that you write when you mean to write? And how you're gonna make sure that you don't let um, things kind of get in your way. So I think I just need to write. Um, so we're gonna prioritize I 
hate that I cannot switch between the British and the American spelling of words like prioritize and summarize and I want to actually I do I want to read it all because I want to meditate so my idea is to kind of meditate maybe before I start writing to kind of clear my head so that I can get straight into it uh, let's just do try because that's not necessarily a routine that I want to keep all the time I just want to get into meditating um, so it doesn't necessarily have to be surrounded by writing so try meditating before before I'm gonna write make it a part of your day Meaning that it would just become part of your daily routine. Um, which I don't have. And then I kind of want to write kind of things that are like valid. Excuses. Essay deadlines. When you don't have time because you need to get an essay deadline. That's a valid excuse. Um, emergencies. And um, I want to put like sick or illness. Put illness. Because many times if you're just like really sick, you just can't do anything. And I re rarely get sick, but when I really get sick, I get really sick. Usually. And I can't think. <laughs> okay, I don't know if the two write-ins a week uh, managed to get in there or my talk about the write-ins, because both of my cameras just went, no. <laughs> you have shot for way too long and... So I don't know, like, but I wrote two write-ins a week because on uh, last NaNoWriMo, the, well, not, yeah, a year ago during NaNoWriMo, I discovered uh, write-ins and they helped a lot to get, like, as many words as I did get and kind of really kept me going. So I wrote two write-ins a week because that's what I want to do. I want to do two write-ins a week. Okay, uh, next is something called If I Succeed and have not reached the word count. And I'm gonna write it down here. And have not reached, it's just gonna go all the way over here. Because I'm kind of expecting this to happen. I'm expecting to um, either finish uh, both of the scripts and not having uh, enough, like having 50,000 words, or I'm expecting that I'm not gonna make it, that I'm not gonna finish both of the scripts and I'm not gonna make 50,000 words. Like complete failure or <laughs> like, managed to finish the scripts um like before the time's up and then have like a little left of the word count um so my plan is to do the project that I meant to do for um for or, or my July nano uh, cam nano which I didn't do which is Project Blood, and then I would kind of try to start writing an outline for that. So we write project. I'm hoping this works because my camera is almost out of <laughs> battery. Project Blood um, outline. And that should fill up like the remainder of my 
uh, word count. The last point I want to do was if I fail, and that's fine. It's okay to fail. Um, I, I'm just gonna write that's okay. That's okay. Because like, I have sat in this service school, it's fine if I don't fail, because I am busy. I have a lot of stuff that I need to do. I have to write three essays. I think I have to take two or three uh, finals. <laughs> I have to read somewhere around 10 books for school, as well as attend lectures and work uh, at least two jobs for a little bit at least. So like, I am busy. So, <laughs> I'm just gonna write, that's okay. You are busy and that's fine. That's my plan. This is what it looks like now. And this is gonna go on my um, cork board that's up here. And remind me that I'm going to make an edit this year. I'm going to write 50,000 words and I'm going to finish. I'm going to have two scripts um, in some form of readiness. So you can let me know if there's anything specific. Like if you have anything you want to do for now. I'm not expecting anything. Um, <laughs> you can like or dislike. Or subscribe. That would be great. But uh, at least, yeah, I think that's it. So, uh, 